So have you ever wondered why helicopters fly around in circles all the time? I'm going to tell you all about it in this video. Hi, I'm Rick James from Pilot Teacher and many people always ask me why do helicopters just fly around in circles? Uh, why do they not just fly up and down in straight lines? And it all comes down to what they need to be doing with the aircraft at the time. Um, police, for instance, will have the camera on the front of the aircraft. Same with the uh, news gathering helicopters. And the easiest way for a cameraman to keep the object in frame is for the aircraft to just circle around the top because as you're circling around the top you can point at one object and no matter where you are in your orbit that object can stay in focus of the camera and most of the time as pilots we're going to be circling around to the left because the person that is wanting to see out of the window is usually sitting in the left seat so i'll be flying circling the aircraft around to the left give them the best view. Um, same if we're doing any survey work. We usually have a guy sitting in the front seat and one or maybe in the left seat behind them. And that puts everything on that side of the aircraft so that then they can get a good view of what they want to look at. And, you know, for as a pilot, it's, it's pretty easy to do. We'll just set up at a height that they want, um, usually 500 feet above the object is pretty good and I'll set up an orbit of around about 60 knots and I'll just sit there 60 knots 500 feet just circling around so they can get the perfect view of what they want to see so if you're sitting at home and you can see the police helicopter doing circles around your house um, chances are it's not going to be looking at you uh, chances are it's going to be looking at somebody else but the one thing that you can do to see if they're looking at you is look up and if they are keeping the same distance away from you you or your house or whatever is in that vicinity is pretty much going to be in the center of attention so if the helicopter just comes over you as it's doing a big orbit once in a while then they're not looking at you but if it's maintaining the same distance away from you or your property all the time they're going to be looking at you or something near to you so um yeah, stop getting up to mischief and the cops are going to not be circling over your uh, property. Um, the other reason what we do uh, orbits for is when I'm coming in to land into an area I've not been to before, like a confined area, or if you're in an air ambulance and they're coming to pick up a uh, patient and they're going to be landing in a baseball diamond or a soccer pitch or something like that, uh, what we'll do first is again, is like 500 feet, 60 knots, and this time I'll be doing it to the right so I can look out my window to look out to see the area that I'm going to be landing into. So I'm going to be looking for things like uh, obstacles on the ground, wires, um, is the ground going to be flat enough and level enough for me to land the aircraft once I get down there? Are there any trees or bushes or are there any debris that's possibly going to fly up once I get down into that area? Um, are there any animals or people that could come into uh, the landing zone as I come in? So things like that are reasons why we do orbits in an aircraft. And it's always to be looking at something on the ground to either film it or provide information to the pilot to ensure that that area can fit the aircraft and it's going to fit it safely. So that's why helicopters orbit. So if you like this, definitely give me a thumbs up. It really helps the channel and uh, subscribe. I've got lots more great videos like this coming out all the time. Uh, make sure you hit that notification bell so you know exactly when my videos come out. And if you have any cool comments or questions, stick them in the uh, comment section below and uh, I'll answer them best I can. We'll get the aircraft out, we'll get the camera out and uh, we'll give you a tour, try and answer your questions. So um, stick around for the next video. I hope you enjoy it and I'll see you on the next one.